at first I'm going to name the software so the software which I'm going to install is a edusic which you can google it so this is the software which can be downloaded from sourceforge.net and this is the freeware software that is the community edition of the software which is available over the internet for free and you can install the software and use it in your school or college and this was available as a GNU that is a general public license version 3.0 so here you can see these are the lists which are available for the EduSec College Management software and most of these things are only available in the original software which was uh, developed by Rudrasoft Technologies so right now what I am going to do is I am just going to install the community edition of the software so you can do whatever you want in the software that is in the community edition of the software and all at your own risk and this video is only for the education purpose and I am not promoting any college management software to use so let's download the software so this is the download link so it will download the software and the latest application which is available is edusec 4.2.5 so I'll just copy and I'll just paste it in my exam folder inside htdocs so I have pasted so I'll make sure that the Apache and MySQL is running so it was running without any issues so I'm just going to extract this software extracted successfully and I'm going to rename it as edusec so I make sure all the contents are available here yeah it was available here so now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to open the edusec in my browser So here you can see it was first asking for the requirement check and here you can see all the things are passed like I have valid MySQL and PHP and the current PHP I, I have is 5.5 and I have the right access to these folders which was inside the EduSec folder and I have valid YA framework so I just don't want to install the YA framework by default it will be available inside the edusec folder itself the file which you are downloading so you don't need to install any other software you just need only the exam control panel software so let's install the edusec just select click here to install the edusec button And it was asking for the license agreement so here you can see it is a school and college management system and which is available for the GNU that is a general public license and I'll just select the checkbox for the agreeing the conditions and select continue here I need to provide the database settings for that I'll just queue localhost that is a local database host name and the user is root there's no password by default there is no password for the exam MySQL database and the database name which I'm going to give is you do sec D and 
select next so it's asking to create a sample database or empty database I'm just going to select the sample database and select next so it will take some time to import the sample database and you need to be patient without cancelling or refreshing the page So here you can see an error has occurred. So let's just open the page and check whether everything is imported. So it was done. So I'll just use a default username and password, which will be available in the SourceForge website itself. So I'm just going to select login here and select the language and give submit and it was done so let's go and check the manage students whether the sample database is updated yeah, it was done so this is how you will install the a to say college management or school management system in your browser so please subscribe for more videos like these thank you for watching the video